Okay, students, I've got my grandpa glasses on because I need to see close up what's going on here. But you're wondering, uh, how do I get my wonderful footage that I just shot on this camera into my MacBook? Okay, so let me just show you how that's done. Uh, everything you record on here records onto SD cards, okay? And we need to get that SD card out of the camera and into our MacBook. So this is how we do it. We just open up the little SD card window right here. That opens up. And then we just press on the first card, which is in the A slot, the A slot. There's nothing in the B slot, but A slot is the one with the card. You press on it and then it will eject the card a little bit, okay? Pushes it out maybe three millimeters, just so you can grab a hold of it. Now you notice there's little gold tabs on it. That's what you need to see as you push it in, okay? So when, you, when you're done and you need to put it back into the camera, you'll make sure that you can see those gold tabs and you put the gold tabs in first and it goes into the slot and then you press it till it clicks and then you can close the window and everything's ready for the next person to use it, okay? Uh, if you have it the wrong way around, if you have it so you don't see the gold tabs and you try to push it in, it's only going to go in just a little bit, maybe like three or four millimeters, and then it'll just stop. Don't force it, okay? You've got it the wrong way. If you force it, it'll probably break the camera and certainly break the SD card. So it's made so it only goes in one way. So just make sure the gold tabs go in first, those little gold guys right there. They go in first, make sure you can see them, and then you push on it till it clicks and then you close the window and now you've got it in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it out again and come with me now and we're gonna go over to my MacBook and we're gonna get the footage from here, this guy, into our MacBook. Okay, so I'm kind of cramped in here so you can see me and see my computer, but let's just uh, go ahead. Uh, first step you need to do is go ahead and launch iMovie, okay? Step number one is launch iMovie to get it into your uh, MacBook. Uh, step number two, if you have a, um, a MacBook Pro that requires the USB-C only on it, you need to get this little adapter and you put the SD card into that. Oh, see it's not going in, which I know I gotta turn it over and then try it the other way and now it goes in. Okay, so you put the SD card into the adapter here and then I can plug that in to my computer. Okay, so plug it in. If you are one of the people that have the little SD card reader on the side of your computer, you don't need that adapter. You'll just put it directly into your computer and it's gonna work the same thing. Now you notice, iMovie detected that I plugged in the SD card. Notice how the screen changed just then? It's like, hey, I found footage for you. Do you want to use it? And you're like, why well, I do, iMovie. Thank you very much. I do want to use this footage. So I see all this footage that's not mine. This isn't me, no, none of this is me. These people up here, they're not me. Okay, so I find at the bottom usually is where you're gonna find yourself. I got two takes that I need down here. So I'm just gonna press um, on one of them and it's gonna highlight with a little yellow uh, band around it. I'm gonna hold down shift. I'm gonna press another one over here just so I have both of those clips selected. I don't know how many clips you've recorded, but just basically start at one side and um, you can either hold down the shift button or command to select multiple ones, okay? So if I've got, again, there's my first one, I hold down command and I can press the next one. Now two of my clips are selected and at the bottom here is the import selected button. I'm gonna tap on that and now those are being imported and I can see that they've happened there and now it says, hey, I'm all done with the card. Right up here it says, do you want to eject the card? And I'm like, yes, I do. I'm gonna eject that. Okay, and I can disconnect it or you pull it out the side if you're one of those MacBooks that have it in the side and now you can go put this back in your camera. Remember, put it in the right way, the one that you can see the gold uh, tabs on it, then you slide it into the camera and everything is good. Now you have your footage here. It shows up right here in um, iMovie and then you can drag that and start editing and doing everything in iMovie, but everything's good. You have the footage now in your MacBook. Congratulations, you've got it from the camera to your MacBook. Now just don't forget to go put this back because I need them. You know, they don't work without them. So thanks you guys.